Welcome back guys. Today is day 155. My name is Christian with today's daily Bible reading. Today we're going to be reading Acts 22, 22 to 30. And they listened to him and tell this word. And then they raised their voices and said, Away with such a fellow from the earth, for he is not fit to live. Then as they cried out and tore their clothes and threw dust into the air, the commander ordered them to be brought into the barracks and said that he should be examined under scourging so that he might know why they are shouting so against him. And as they bound him with tongs, Paul said to the centurion who stood by, Is it lawful for you to scourge a man who is a Roman and uncondemned? When the centurion heard that, he went and told the commander, saying, Take care what you do, for this man is a Roman. Then the commander came and said to him, Tell me, are you a Roman? He said, Yes. And the commander answered, With a large sum I obtained this citizenship. And Paul said, but I was born a citizen. Then immediately those who were about to examine him withdrew from him, and the commander was also afraid after he found out that he was a Roman and because he had bound him. The next day, because he wanted to know for certain why he was accused by the Jews, he released him from his bonds and commanded the chief priests and all the council to appear and brought Paul down and set him before them. Let's go ahead and pray. Dear Heavenly Father, I thank you for your word. I thank you for your blessing and your guidance God please continue to convict us and lead us to repentance um, to read your word and to understand at a deeper level God please give us that um, interpretation and your discernment and Lord because we don't battle against flesh and blood that we battle against spiritual beings in high places Lord I just pray that you help us compete against these things Lord I just hope that you help us understand What's the truth? And go back to your word, Lord. Holy Spirit, I pray that you help us understand your word, what correct actions we should take, and how to move forward. I pray this in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. For day 156, go ahead and click on the link on the screen, and I'll see you guys in the next one.